Hello my lovelies, Bridget Kitley here again and today I'm going to be telling you how to make your own olive oil soap and it is quite precise with your measurements etc so what I'm saying in terms of measurements adhere to but what I'm going to do first and foremost is this is 700 grams of palm kernel oil so I'm going to put this in my little saucepan my big saucepan my next thing I'm going to add in is 200 grams of olive oil this is coconut oil which is 100 grams so all that is going to be melted over the stove in the kitchen in a moment this is caustic soda i.e lye which is used to unblock drains and do all sorts of ghastly things and it causes the saponification in the oils always add your caustic soda in before the water never ever use plastic bowls with caustic soda because they will melt then I'm going to put in 320 ml of just ordinary tap water. I'm not wearing gloves, I'm not wearing protective glasses, but I do recommend you do wear protective plastic gloves or protective gloves of some kind. So I'm gonna use a wooden spoon in the caustic soda with the water and I'm gonna stir it very gently because you don't want it to splash. And if I feel this, it's very hot. This is the important part. I have to put in a thermometer. So you're going to see that it's getting up to quite a degree. Can you see? This has to be 45 degrees. So I am now going to go and melt the oils in the kitchen. Okay, now I've got my oil 45 degrees centigrade. I've got my caustic soda in the water 45 degrees centigrade. Now I'm going to start whizzing with my blitzer, excuse the noise, and add in the caustic soda. When it starts to trace, it starts getting a bit moosey and forms a line on the top. This is now tracing. It gets to this kind of moosey consistency where if you take your blender like this, you can see that it's getting thick on the top. So I've got to act quickly now. I'm going to put in about 15 ml of grapefruit essential oil. You can put in any essential oil you like. And then I'm going to whiz it in quickly and I'm going to pour it in the mold, then we're done. And there we are. So here is your soap going in. Just to settle it. Give it a bit of a bang. I like it looking homemade. I don't want it to look perfect. So this is the soap that will harden. I have already done one, which I made last night. And this now can be chopped up into slices. And then the final, that is my little soap. Keep it for at least a week or two before using it to harden it up. Um, don't use it within the 24, 48 hour period because the caustic soda is still working in this particular bar because this is only a few hours old. I've left it overnight. Make your own soap and save money.